salamu karibu tena mpenzi mtazamaji wa runinga ya Captain TV uko ndani ya the show ina ambayo ni the expert ni kipindi ambacho kinakuja kila siku ya Ijumaa masaa ya saa moja jioni hivi leo katika studio tuko naye msanii Abi ambaye mm. anatuelekeza ili tuweze kujumuika naye zaidi na tujifunze mengi sana kuhusu muziki yani music industry na mambo kweli eh hebu tumsikize Kumuja nilipikiwa simu Ilikuwa simu ya mwaliko Jumapili tutamshukuru mu kwa sadaka ya peke Uje uimbe kanisa ni kwetu Muda ulipofika wimbo nikapiga wa kaja mbele wamemtanguliza kichana na binti mmoja msemaji wa kanza kutoa hotuba fupi kabla sadaka ijatolewa mungu ninakushukuru sana mungu kwa kumponya Binti yangu waliye ugu wakicha Pia Nina kushukuru sana mwani Kijana uyo Alionyesha upendo waja Nilipo mwambia Atana na mwanangu wakufai tena Yeye alijibu Isha mpenda nita hivyo hivyo Sijawa hiyo na upendo kama huu Sijawa hiyo na upendo kama huu Wow, tuwachia hapo? Wow, wow, wow Sijawa hiyo na upendo kama huu Yes Wimbo hatari Mbona Mbona bendera? Wewe by the way hii hii asiati ni kitu by the way venye nini yangu ni sinaga string ya kuvaa. Yaani hivyo eh sasa tunaekaga hapo. Unaona? Yaani sasa tunachapa mziki tukiwa tume tukiwa tume tume nini? Yaani ni kadhani ya kwamba ni mkenya mzalendo. Ah hii venye sina strap but pia ni sawa kama ina represent Kenya is fine. So ni mpaka tu hivi ili kuweza ku kucheza vizuri. Eh bwana una makeke kweli eh? Bwana ndio. <laughs> makeke <laughs> lazima kwa industry. Ukwa na makeke nzuri. Ndio hivyo sasa. Mm. Na kuna huu wimbo ambao ulijaribu kuandika lakini ukaona kwamba ni mgumu kweli eh. Mm. Ulikuchukua siku ngapi? Hmm. kuna si... Okay, si hii nyimbo siku haiku nichukua muda kwa sababu ati ilikuwa ngumu. Ni vitu ilikuwa emotion, emotional sana mm. kwangu wakati nilikuwa nauandika. Kuna rafiki yangu fulani alikuwa anaitwa anaitwa Onil, Onil Nyanze. He's ni kama mentor, very close. Mm. Alikuwa na msichana fulani ulikuwa ame date for a long time. Mhm. Unajua leo watu wana date mpaka mnaambia yeah. guys come on lean yes. sasa. Eh? Yeah. Lini? Yaani mume date sana. Eh hey, but it's about time man. It's about time. <laughs> oh, by the way kama kuna mtu ananisikiza hapo nje usidate msichana watu for long. Ndet kidogo umuoe bani. Ama umwache. Una 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 mdeti kwa siku ngapi? Mdeti tu kama inajua ile sikio bila ambapo mtu ata 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 atamjua mwanzake. Kuna wale ambao after 6 months you know when I feel they are ready whenever the feeling is right it is right to do it. Yeah. So waka eventually walioana. I think like 8 years of uh, of courtship. But then after they got married after a short while dema kapasi hata yani ile tu ameoana tu hivi hata hakukata hako enjoy life sana akapasi and it was such a hard time for everyone mwenye alijua onil na mwenye alijua the lady alikuwa anaitwa tina may, may the lord bless her soul mm. it was such an it was such a tough time for everybody for everybody because this is somebody mwenye nyote mnamjua si ati John umeenda umedet them mal fulani then ah ah tumegrona nyinyi wote tunawajua nyinyi wote wawili mm-hmm. you know so it was it was really hard for us and of course for O'Neil mm-hmm. yeah 
hivi hivi kakuwa kwako ngumu sana kuandika wimbo sio mm, so it was like later kabisa mm. i was you know there was a project ilikuwa inaitwa ilikuwa inaitwa nini nimesawiyo jina but ilikuwa inaleta artists wote mm-hmm. wa coast wafanye album some mm-hmm. sort of an album ya i think ilikuwa around 20 songs so mimi ndo ndikuwa the highlight artist mm-hmm. kwa hiyo album mm. so i i was supposed to do a song pia though i was i was already kwa na Nairobi tayari so nikafanya hiyo ngome kwa ndio tina kokoma yes mm-hmm. yeah ivo so, ivo unajua kuna wimbo huenda ukiwandika unaona mgumu sana kweli eh mm. labda mistari haiji oh no. mimi kama mstari haijua naachana nayo kama ngoma nimeandika more than 2 days sitaandika tena uh-huh. yeah naachana na abi yes abi ni nani kando na mziki Abi kando na mziki ni ni mfanyakazi wa shirika la, ta, la utangazaji la taifa mm-hmm. you know, KBC. Mm-hmm. Uh, Abi pia ni mzazi. Wow. You know, I've uh, been a single parent for 10 years now. Mm-hmm. You know, my daughter is 10 years, she's uh, turning uh, she's going to class 5 next year. So she's wow. in class 4. Wow. Angera um, bwana. Yeah. Asante mzee. Asante <laughs> sana. <laughs> Uh, also I am uh, I am most, almost close to getting married. So yeah, I am dating right now. Wow. And uh, of course uh, William Rembambo na date nae pia tume God am to bless mm-hmm. tumepata pia one little girl she's mm-hmm. two years old. Mm-hmm. Yes. Wow, beautiful. Yeah. Nam um kando kando na muziki labda kuna wasanii wengine pia uh, huwa na mambo mengi sana ambao wanayafanya maisha. Mm. Um, tuseme kuna msanii fulani una unaangazia sana labda ungelikuwa kama yeye yani nani anakupatia challenge katika hii industry challenge si ai si dani mimi sidhani kama kuna msanii anaifanya kama mimi bro cuz mimi naifanya vile nafaa kufanya so hakuna mtu mimi naamini hapa ndio home watu ile siku watanisikiza mm-hmm that's it na sasa watu wameanza kutega masikio and i have a great message for guys out there mm-hmm. i promise mm-hmm. i have beautiful messages siku moja tu you know they are gonna listen mm. na kando na wana habari unajua wewe ni mwanafunzo wa wana habari yes na hiyo ndiyo kazi yako ambayo unaifanya yes mbona ukaamua kwenda kwenye muziki kwa sababu muziki ilikuwa ndiyo na my number one passion na mimi i truly i truly believe in speaking ama preaching of what you of of what you say mm. ama usiseme usiambie watu msifanye hivi alafu bado mwisho una unakuja unafanya tofauti you know so i want one day to be able to tell my daughters that i followed my dream mm. you know i went for my dreams i did not give up on my dream mm. you know and that is one thing i want to be proud of in my life sitaki kuja later msichana wangu akuja atake kuwa na kitu fulani ama awe atakuwa daktari ama atakuwa pia mwanamuziki ama dancer whatever she wants to be alafu mimi niwe sina ule uwezo ama sina ile authority ya kumwambia baby go for your go for your dreams chase after your dreams atakuuliza wewe dadi si ulikuwa unaimba kitambo mbona uliacha kuimba because you did not chase for your dreams so you can't tame them so legacy legacy yes abi ana jona miaka mitano atakuwa wapi Yeah. Yeah, nitajiona na familia watoto watano. Uh, pia <laughs> well, That is not a joke by the way. That is serious. <laughs> anyway, I'm just joking. <laughs> Nini um of course it, it, my music career na natazamia pia kuwa mali ambapo nimefanya albums kadhaa mm-hmm. kama sasa hii next year nimepanga kufanya my first album mm-hmm. ambayo ndio nimekwambia nitoa Zouk the African I love rhythm mm-hmm. e, pia my it is my deep i have na kuanga na moyo wa kupeana sana na kuanga na moyo wa ku give back mm-hmm. and right now niko involved na a few people kama uko hapo mko hapo enjoy guys na uko na vitabu ambazo utumii vitabu ambazo you don't need mm-hmm. nja kusoma tafadhali mm-hmm. reach out that's mm-hmm. abinguma mm-hmm. on social media hizo vitabu ninazihitaji kuna vijana ambao I mentor uh-huh. in Saika you know and I'm trying to cultivate a, a culture you know ya vijana ambao tunapenda kusoma because mm-hmm. I believe mwanamume ambao akona intellect inakuwa noma sana mm-hmm. inakuwa mzuri sana unalea 
unakuwa mwanamme wa nyumba una, una, unakuwa unaweza kusimama na useme mm -hmm. I have taken authority of the home cool. and the people respect that mm. you know but you cannot do that mm. if you're not smart mm. up here cool. yes. mm. na um, kuna baadhi ya changamoto ambazo wengi hupitia mm. mimi kama mwana habari nimepitia changamoto mm. pia kiasi yes. wewe kama mwanamuziki kuna baadhi ya changamoto tu ambazo umezipitia mm. na labda ndizo zimekukuza hadi wa leo mm. siyo ni kama zipi hivi ambazo umeweza kukumbana nazo katika hali ya muziki yes mm. changamoto ni mingi sana ni mingi sana ni mingi mingi sana and if you are a young artist out there who wants to start out and you and you are a faint hearted mm -hmm. please don't you will go into depression you will you will you will be in a bad place but if this is your passion and if this is what you really want to do with your life and you're ready to chase after your dreams for years because mimi ni member kwa miaka mimi ni member for a long long time mimi mm hatusija -hmm. record probably but i have been singing all my life na sijawahi give up so any artist mwenye yako hapo nje siku moja unajua siku mm -hmm. moja itafika Kali. siku yako pia itafika so don't give up wherever you are mm -hmm. so uh, challenges one of the challenges ni getting your material out there mm -hmm. just like any other job getting people to recognize and trust your brand mm -hmm. that you you can deliver mm -hmm. is the first challenge the second challenge is of course piracy it is a huge problem kusabu when you go perform somewhere mtu mm -hmm. anarecord nyimbo zako unapata nyimbo zako zimeshatoka zime mm -hmm. na ujata record so piracy is a huge you know damage to our industry mm -hmm. na lafo pia another challenge ni converting our music to money that's another challenge because mm. unapata wasanii ni wengi wanajua wanajua kuimba wanajua ku record na wame hit but hawajui ata translate sasa hiyo kujulikana na hiyo fame mm -hmm. age into money that's one another challenge so i don't know probably the ministry of uh, culture mm -hmm. could do something about that mm -hmm. you know ku sensitize to wasanii na wa, you know hours wanafanyanga art ambao si wanafanya art yani si ati tutakwambia wewe smart shika hii kitabu mm -hmm nipatie pesa mm. hii ni, ni mziki kama saa hii nikam interview hivi yes. what mimi kama artist nafaa ku demand for what mm -hmm. na wewe kama mtangazaji unafaa ku demand for so there's that hiyo professionalism mm. that's a, another challenge ya kwamba hatujui ku translate pesa uh, fame ama kujulikana ama mm -hmm. our art into money mm -hmm. and the last challenge is wasanii tunakuwa very very unprofessional that's also another challenge si kwetu but to other people mm -hmm. because they make other works ama other people kazi hiyo inakuwa ngumu sana sababu hawako professional kuna kuna baadhi ya wasanii ambao wanaimba labda kwa sababu wamejifunza muziki mm. hiyo si dhani kama hiyo ni talanta unajua kuna wale kuimba muziki maana yake wametoka shule ya shule ya muziki mm. ndipo wanaimba sasa yes na talanta labda haipo hebu mm. utawapatia uhusia gani sasa sasa mimi sijui maana wewe kama wanahabari umesoma wanahabari huku talanta ni muziki Mm. Ndio hivyo. Mungu anaweza kupata talanta mingi smart. Uh, Biblia inasema um, kuna ile parable kwamba tulipoa talents. Mm -hmm. Na at the end of it all Mungu anakuambia yule ambaye alipoa talents tano atakuja hokonywe kama hatazitumia na zitapiana kwa yule ambaye ametumia talents zake vizuri. Mm -hmm. You know. So me I believe if you think you can do something really really good mm -hmm professionally and you can ask you can confidently ask somebody to pay you mm. after you've done that thing and go for it but mimi si mimi siamini sana na mambo ya talanta honestly mm -hmm. mimi naamini sana na bidii ya mtu naamini mm -hmm. sana na consistency yani kujitoa kabisa mwanga yes uji. yes yes yeah. i believe mm -hmm. ni wale watu wa kuamini you can do anything mm -hmm. you can really really do anything mm -hmm. if you put your your heart into it you can really you can do anything mm. kuna watu wengi sana tumeona ambao hawaja hawawezi kufanya kitu but hawakuacha kwa sababu watu waliwaambia hawawezi mm -hmm. waliendelea waliendelea because they could they believe in their heart mm -hmm. and deep down that i can do i mean unajua ile kitu unakuwa convicted yes. unajua i i truly hata mm -hmm. tunakwambia ah, we smart mm -hmm. ah, we bana hii kupresent yako kidogo autosha haujaiva poa <laughs> uko poa but yeah. unajafika mm -hmm. you know but wewe unajua kabisa unajitahidi kabisa eh, unajua eh. kwa mwako i can do this i feel mm -hmm. i can do it hata kuna kitu ambacho hujawahi fanya hata siku moja hujawahi hata fanya but ukiangalia unasema in your heart i can do that thing mm -hmm. then you can do it kuna mambo mengi ambayo umeyapangia 
na labda kuna mengine bado haujatimiza yes. labda kuna yale mambo umesema kwamba katika industry ya muziki kuna vitu baadhi ambavyo ume, umeshatimiza labda kuna riwaza fulani mm. umefikiri hapa wale ukasema kwamba hili jambo nitalitimiza kwa wakati fulani mm. kuna mambo mengi sana labda umeyatimiza tayari yani tuseme kwamba ni achievements zile ambazo umefanya katika muziki yes. ni kama zipi um, ukiuliza niko na awards gani sina hapa moja and uh, ukiuliza kama nimekuwa recognized anywhere takwambia pia sijawahi kuwa recognized anywhere kwa sababu that's the truth mm-hmm. sina award oh niko na award moja na i don't think if it counts Utakosaje. i don't think if it counts <laughs> but uh, i think unajua mtu ambaye anapewa award ni mtu ambaye his work is out there mm-hmm. mtu ambaye amesikia kwa radio na tv in kenya that is mm-hmm. kama your material is not out there kidogo inakuwa ngumu sana mm-hmm. kupata award alafu pia awards sana sana Kenya zimekuwa za the gospel industry mm-hmm. sisi ambao watu chapi gospel kidogo imekuwa imekuwa tricky hatujakuwa na awards ambazo zinazawadia eh, watu ambao wafanye gospel music mm-hmm. yeah so imekuwa kidogo very very tricky mm, but i have however impacted lives mm-hmm. sana sana uh, last year i was uh, i was invited i did a song called uh, rudi nyumbani Rudi nyumbani yes wimbo mzuri wa. yes ah. rudi nyumbani was a song that i wrote for a, a end of life care hospital unajua pale ambapo watu wana kama uko na cancer mm-hmm. you know kama uko na probably hiv and aids mm-hmm. you know those diseases ambazo tu probably unangoja tu you know just to to pass away and your family can't take care of you anymore mm. that is where you go now just to wait for your day mm-hmm. so when i was going there i, I was feeling really heavy niko na jiuliza mimi sijai kuwa na magonjwa unajua sije experience such mm-hmm. a thing mm-hmm. nitawaambia nini hao watu what am i going to say to these people but when i reached there nikapata people who are full of life na kama umeona hiyo ngoma probably uta, utachezea jamaa waione mm-hmm. inaitwa rudi nyumbani it is it is a very emotional song and it is a good song so pia nime mentor a few musicians ama a few guys here and there you know sisi tutaja kila mtu ambaye nime come across mm. but uh, my heart is full yes my heart is full nam uh, abi yes sir kuna unajua wasanii wengi wanapenda vyakula tofauti mm wewe mwenyewe unajipikia chakula aina gani unakipenda sana? Bwana mimi unajua ni mzazi, kwa hivyo upishi mimi nimeiva. <laughs> mimi ni mpishi hodari. Mm-hmm. Si, labda sita kupikia pizza na nini na nini lakini nitakupikia chakula kitamu. But my favorite food sasa hii ni ugali na nini mboga tu ya kienyeji kama hata sukuma wiki, kama hizo. Unajua mimi napenda ugali na morenda tu na pork. pork. That is my jam kwanza wewe ndio unapenda vyakula vya kwangu. Mambo <laughs> <laughs> yangu kwa hapa. abi ni nini hasa ambacho kinakufanya uwe abi? Mm. Yaani kuendelea bila kuchoka eh? kuangalia nyuma na kusema kwamba ah hata kama nitoka mbali hivi azidi. Ah yani ni nini hasa kinakusukuma una eh? Yaani moral ambayo mm. inakuelekeza sana katika kufikia ile iwaza yako. Me by the way, smart dream, dream dream yangu mazee ni kufikia tu ase. Ni watu wasikize mziki yangu. Hiyo ndo dream yangu. Mm. Sasa sema ati nitaka of course nitaka mziki siku moja inilipe inipatie mado mingi na nimwe magari poa poa. Mm. But I'm doing that already with my job. Mm. Nataka siku moja wasee wa tune in to abi nguma na wasikize mziki yake. Oh. That is what keeps me going. Mm. Na sitawaacha mazee mpaka ile siku nitafi, nitaka ni seme I have done it now i can hang my guitar mm. and do other things but until then twende nalo twende nalo wow hatari hiyo eh mazi ni bd 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 kila kitu mazi ni bd na kwa any young any young person out there bd by the way na itakufikisha place hata wale wenye wanafanya kazi saa hii watakwambia mm-hmm. ile siku nakaaga nyumbani hata ule msema kuna deni yako akulipa gio siku ile sikutamoka nyumbani the whole day 
<laughs> Hiyo siku by the way hakuna msiata hata ni msi unamdai doa alikuwa akamwambia takulipa kesho abi. Uh-huh. Hata kutumia kesho. Batamua tu siku hata kama you have nothing to do just step out just go out mm. just go. Mm. Get out of the house. Hiyo mm. <laughs> siku utafa, undo utalipa. Hiyo siku utapata hiyo siku utapata wasendo wa mama wanalipa wanalipa mshandeo siku. Imagine ile siku wa kutia bidi it was mm-hmm. isi yet necessarily yeah. atenda kufanya kazi ulipo hiyo siku hapa uh-huh. unaweza kwa toto undo umetoka umekakomati ndio titi nacheki hivi msi alikuwa na deni yako sijui au deni yazi amekwambia ni aja habi kuna kamera dikale kama through <laughs> ndio ndo yako nimekurudisha hiyo you know? uh-huh. so bd 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 ya mchwa maze mm. blind 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 hard work mm. ile you know this is what you want go for it push mm-hmm. for it push push for it mm-hmm. ah maze mimi ni muona wasi ambao bd mwafikisha place zenye ni unimaginable maze hata si wenye hata wakati kwa tunasoma kuna watu ambaye alikuwa yeye ha, hashiki yeye maze but huo ndo msiona mwana na rauka kamazi asubuhi kwenda kusoma mimi and eventually sasa hiyo kiwaangalia wale wenye walikuwa napata man, man number one nini nini mm. you don't really see them anywhere mm-hmm. unajiuliza eh yule msiona kwa napata number one alielewa yeah, yeah. naambia eh mse bana aliingia kwa mavitu bana sikuizi hata ajielewi but yule mse mwenye yani yeye alikuwa tu na bidii ameniachilia tu yani alikuwa tu hapo tu yeah. shule he was an average student alikuwa uh-huh. tu hapo no uh-huh. is the one making headlines mm. no no hey this mm. guy is doing one two three things and your flan flan you know mm. flan you know mm. and you are like wow okay kwa hivyo Mungu pia uzawadia bidii sana mm. akikuangalia akuona hmm kwa sababu Mungu mwenyewe alisema hata alisema tu yule mwenye afanye job asidishi na ni baada ni nakwanga tu hivyo period Nipendilia. like inakwanga tu black and white ipo if you don't work you will not eat Kweli. and that is why you find so many young boys ama young men out there mm. kama kina sisi mm. tuna run for the easy way out you know going for older women you know um, doing things ambazo ni kama mimi i was mm. almost getting to crime you know and you see hizo 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 mcheza kuhepa hepa mm-hmm. ndio mwishowe zinakuja zinakufanyia vitu mbaya sana mm-hmm. you know but ukitia bidi na uki focus you just need to find that one thing in it mm-hmm. a direction mm-hmm. for me you know is is my family mm-hmm. you mean niko na majukumu sina otherwise lazima ni hustle ama watu talala nja you know so find that one thing that that pushes you mm-hmm. ile yenye hata hata utake huwezi mm-hmm. epuka mm-hmm. then let that thing drive you uh-huh. you know kama ni rent unasema niki kosa kulipa rent nimefukuzwa hii keja mm-hmm. let that be maybe the iwe tu the, the short term goal and then you will see what happens uh-huh. mimi probably hatuna time but i would have told you so many stories about guys wenye wametia bd say tu mse wewe unibeba hapa na bike mm. aliuza hadi unalipanga pesa ngapi kwako nikamwambia nikamwambia oh mimi nitafika huko tena nikamwambia ni venye place huko sasa hivi umekuwa comfortable Nenda utokeo place unakaa wende place unalipa 2000 shillings zaidi. Mm. You will see something happens. Ile time unasema by the way, wacha nirudi shule by faith. Doi inatoka anga. Ah. Doi inatoka anga. Utajua. But kaa tu home useme eh ile siku nitapanda dondo nitaenda shule. Mm. Man, azito story. Kweli kabisa. Na um tunapomalizia hiki kipindi labda kuna mwanamuziki fulani anajaribu kuangalia na anashangaa mtakupata vipi unapatikana wapi eh hmm. utaonekana kwenye runinga lakini wanakupata wapi unapatikana wapi haswa kwenye mtandao wapi haswa yeah uh, mimi am a very social person mm-hmm. smart unajua uki reach out to me bora ni kitu ni conversation ina make sense mm-hmm. mimi nitakusikiza but kama mm-hmm. umekuja hapo na stories zako mingi utakula utakula ma blue tick but kama uko na kama uko na a, you know a real issue mm-hmm. real agenda like ni because maybe i have this channel also ni wanachukua na kina kwa rund whenever you can inbox the first thing i ask you is what do you want ukusaidiaje mm. ukianza tu ukishaanza tu story kando from you swali nimekuuliza ah i will not even read your next message but if you have a real issue come through i come through pia mimi so abi nguma social media that's a double b i h n g u m a abi nguma reach out man Let's talk let's vibe let's spread good vibes all around you know wow yeah ukitazama ile kamera pale labda kuna jamaa mmoja anafikiria kwamba eh hapa tumekuwa <laughs> eh naomba na uzungumuze uzungumuze na na huyu mtazamaji ambaye anatazama hiki kipindi na kuona abi hapa anacheza gitaa ni mwanamuziki anaimba pia ni mwanahabari 
mpatie huyu mtazamaji husia tu mm. ama labda useme kwamba ni secret fulani ambayo unaitumia mm. ili itaweza kumpatia pia uh, changamoto fulani ili naye aamke na kutafuta yes mm. Um, truth is, uh, so many people smart out here are hurting, and that is the truth. And uh, <laughs> it's funny because babu, each generation yetu si watu wa kuongea about our problems. Mm. Si nyolo watu wa kukanyegia tu, unajua. Mm. Like, you, you are going through a lot, but you don't say it. Mm-hmm. So, kuna marafiki, you know, every weekend you guys are having fun. Na mnajibamba, mm. na, and wana unatulu life yako yiko sawa, but mm. when you're alone, you're sad and you're and you're miserable. Mm. Kitu mimi naweza kuambia tu hapo nje ni find find a purpose, you know, find a purpose for your life. You know, uh if 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 you have somebody to talk to, please reach out because there are people who want to help. But the problem is ukinyamaza sisi hatujua what is going on unless we are really close to you. So if you are out there and you're trying everything and it's failing there is always that verse in in the bible that drives me every day mm-hmm. and it, it says that do not worry about anything but through prayer and persistence yes. you know make your requests known to god mm-hmm. and everything and the lord will you know the uh, and the lord will guide you in christ jesus mm-hmm. and you know in that transcends that peace that transcends all human understanding will mm-hmm. guide you in christ jesus Amen. and that is all we need all you need is peace all you need is love. So spread good vibes. Usque, usque the reason somebody else is going through a tough time. Usque the reason somebody else is crying. And don't go out there hurting people. If you're dating, don't go out there. Uh, don't go out there hurting other people's daughters. If you're a girl, don't go out there and breaking men's hearts. Because these are people. So don't be a reason mtu atakuwa na a sad life ama ata go through a dark time in their life yako. Be your brothers and your sisters keeper. Yeah. Wow. I can be serious sometimes, guys. Okay, watch and dilute your 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 dini. Ivo ya fa. Ni sana. You know? Ni muhimu sana yeah. mtapate. Guys, waso waso na hati ana by the mm. way. Guys mm. are really mm. are really hurting each other. Hata map hata yeah. kwa job unapata mm. wasio wanachomeana. Hata mm. kwa biashara unapata mm. msia na kuseti. Mm. And and it is really really it is really, really sad see poor by the way this, it is any was it it is enough mm. we have a huge steak we have a cake ni big mazee kula si wote sisi wote tunaweza dishi mazee tunaweza kula tunaweza pata do mm-hmm. industry ni kubwa manze ya ku really? you have really to kabisa. explore eh hey, usikanyage ah, mwenzako mm. usikanyage mwenzako kweli yeah naam usimkanyage mwenzako mm. eh ni hatari sana kwa ile tumekuwa naye msanii hapa abi Guma ambaye ni mwanamuziki na pia anacheza gita. Atatupatia muziki ambao anaupenda sana kati ya muziki ambayo ameimba yote katika sekta hii ya muziki. Na umekuwa nami Joso Smart katika hiki kipindi unachokienzi sana cha The Expert kinakujia kila siku ya Ijumaa masaya saa moja jioni. Usibanduke, hebu tumsikize Abi Guma. Umetenda mengi na sijui kule wala wapiku wanzia watu wote wafahamu muhimu wako umetenda mengi hata sijui kueleza wala wapiku wanzia watu wote wafahamu muhimu wako wapi wapi eti wapi mwanzo wapi nakumbuka mwanzo tulipopata na hatukufanana tukajavamiana wala sikudhania tungezoeana unifai mimi na mimi kufai La 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 Say we mchoshi nikiwa na we mimi naona raha moyo wangu unaburudika si 
shida zote naziweka kando yo Waomba nami uwe wapi uwe wapi ina shida nitakueleza mimi na wewe talia kwa mola pamoja wani pamoyo mara nyingi uwasiti ya mi hata nikiwa nimejara uoga wani kumbusha kwa Yesu yu nami Umetenda mengi na sijui kueleza wala wapi kuanzia watu wote wafahamu namshukuru Mola kwa marafiki wote alonijalia umechangia pakubwa maisha ni mwangu I brother to sana abi it was a total honor man very much thank you sir Asante. thank you so much thank you for having me keep keep watching this guy he's a he's a great guy i know it's been years it's been what <laughs> around 6 7 years trust me coming from me tune in to this guy man he's going to teach you he's going to edify you get stuff man just smart i'm a proud brother a proud man too cheers man thank you may god bless you man see you guys see ya